What I'm gonna do is show you guys how to deal with pizza dough that is too wet. Look at this. It's a, it's a sloppy mess of pizza dough. <laughs> you see that else? It's pretty intense. So I'm gonna show you how to handle that because sometimes when you make pizza, you may or may not forget to add enough flour, which is, I think this is what happened uh, with this particular batch of dough. So first you just gotta flip your dough over like this and sometimes it needs a little help. So I'm gonna pat my hand down there. Oh, it came out on its own. Okay, oh dear, oh dear. This is like, this is like dough soup right here. <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at this, just a nightmare. Okay, so you gotta, you gotta obviously offset the moisture with some flour on there. Holy crap, this is some pretty wet dough, I'll tell you what. But it's workable, and to be honest, I actually think really wet dough tastes freaking awesome in the oven. Um, the hotter your oven is, the wetter you actually want your pizza dough to be so that you can retain some of the the moisture in the crust. So what's super important about this process is obviously we're we're caking on the flour so we can work with the dough, right? But when you cook a pizza and it's caked in flour, it doesn't taste very good because the flour will burn and then it just makes the flavor not so bueno. So what I'm gonna do is I have my, my pizza peel really close by, and I'm gonna actually put a little bit of flour on my pizza peel as well to prep that. I don't know if you guys can see that. Probably can't. So I'm gonna be very generous with the flour on my pizza peel. Okay, so I've got that nearby. And then what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna pick up the dough with my hands kinda down, like my fingers pointed down towards the ground like this. That way, I don't poke holes in the dough, because this dough is fragile. This is some tender dough right here. We don't wanna, we don't wanna break it when it's so tender. Okay, so let's do the transfer, shall we? So I'm gonna first pick it up like this. My hands are underneath it, like that. And then I'm gonna transfer it over, just like that. This dough you can't even really pick up. So now I'm gonna, <laughs> oh my gosh. This is crazy. This is probably like some of the wettest dough I've ever, I've ever dealt with as a pizza chef dude. I don't know, a person that makes pizza. That's what I am. Okay, so this is gonna be messy and I don't recommend doing this at all, but sometimes you need to blow under it so that you can get some of this dough, sorry, some of the flour off the bottom of your, of your dough, like that, because it's gonna cook weird. And then I've also, do your best to uh, brush the excess flour off of the top as well, because um, it not only tastes weird on the bottom, but it will also taste weird on the top. Okay, so it's good, it's, it's gonna slide. I can, I can feel that. But when your dough is this wet, you gotta be pretty quick when it comes to making the pizza, okay? So. Okay, I've got my my ladle here, 
I'm just gonna throw it right in the center like this. Okay. We'll see how this, this shakes out. Shake it out. This is not my normal ladle that I use, so don't judge me as I try and spread the sauce on here. I like uh, just like a, this. see how it's like a half? It's not very deep, this ladle isn't very deep. I like more of the, the deeper ladles that are more like rounded, because uh, then you can leverage each of the sides better. Oh my gosh, I just used the word leverage. I've been at work all day today, and we use silly words like that all day long. Okay, so this is the this is the queso fresco. This is the Mexican cheese that I'm putting on here. And I'm not putting a ton on, obviously, because I don't have a ton that I've prepared. <laughs> so, and I'm also planning to put some feta cheese on here as well. And so, let's just oh, open that up. And I'm just gonna dump it like so. We'll see how this, we'll see how this baby cooks. Okay, we should be uh, ready to go. So you wanna make sure that it slides. Yep, it's gonna slide. Oh, this is a heavy dough. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay, I'm gonna go pop this baby in the oven. See you in a minute.